Yo, yo, YouTube, what's going on, boys? Hope you guys are having a good day today. I'm back with another video. Um, guys, I want to talk about uh, having experiences with females and how everything has changed, you know, and how these interactions with, with females now are completely different. You know, when you go on semen retention versus somebody who is still on the websites, who is still living in their lust, who is still actually actively chasing women, you know, cause that's the big shift, right? You go on semen retention for a while. Hopefully, you know, your head is in the right space. Cause like I've said in other videos, a lot of guys are going to end up going on semen retention just for the women. And that's not the move you guys. That's, that's going to put you in a dead end. You know, it's a vicious cycle, right? You're just going to get with the girl and then you're going to go back to being that old version of yourself, you know, to where you're going to be the guy that you went on, that you were before you went on semen retention. You know, it's not going to end up good for you. So once you're truly on that pathway and you truly have this shift to where you can put that kind of on the back burner, uh, females are going to hit different <laughs> females in general, just interacting with girls. is going to be different, you guys. And I wanted to get into that one a little bit here. So guys, after a little period of semen retention, you're going to be seeing the world completely different. Okay. Your discernment is going to be kicking in and you're going to be able to understand who is low vibrational, who is high vibrational, you know, just by the way people behave, you know, the way that they're acting, little body language, uh, their tone of voice, the things that they post on social media. Um, the list is endless, you guys, but this is one of the things that happens to you on semen retention is that you're going to be able to see things before they happen. You know, you're going to be able to see a lot of these girls that come out here and, you know, you can tell the difference between a girl who wears a lot of makeup and a girl who, who doesn't wear makeup and she's, you know, comfortable in her own frame, right? Um, it's very obvious, you know, a lot of this stuff. So it's a whole shift, you guys. And, and then when you're going on semen retention, you also get into that shift to where you're able to understand that, you know, your mission is more important than chasing women. Once you get that dialed into where you're not really out here looking to chase women, you know, it, it puts you in a, in a different category, bro. Like you, you get put into this category where, you know, energetically now women are going to be able to sense that in you, you know, they're going to be able to sense that you're not simping, that you're not putting them on a pedestal that, you're okay without them. You know, there's so many guys out here that are operating in that way where um, the, the, the women can sense that that guy is desperate. You know, he's operating in a place, operating from a place of lack, you know, like, like he's not okay by himself. Like he just really wants to be with this girl. He really just, you know, he's got to have gotta have you type shit you know women know that women can sense that energetically and they can sense if you're a guy who isn't thinking like that right so if you're confident in yourself you know you're just going around and acting like you don't need you know that girl to make you feel feel good you know you feel whole by yourself right you doing your mission and you you know your relationship with god so um we get into a place where we start to protect our peace over getting with women, you know, and that, that puts you in a space where that's the energy that you're going to be putting out. You know, you'd rather stay home, um, get ready for the, for the next day, maybe wake up early, get a workout in, uh, go to work, you know, start making more money, all these things, you guys, we would rather do that than be chasing women, you know? So women are going to be able to pick up all these things, you guys. Um, it sets you apart when, when we can get into a place, get into that space where uh, we master that art of not caring, you know, not caring about the results, you know, to where you're going around different types of females and you don't care about the results, right? Because you're focused on other things. You're focused on your mission. You're focused on staying on semen retention, focused on getting better health, maybe making money, whatever it is that you do, right? Uh, 
That's where we should be, boys. We should be focused on our mission over chasing women. There's so many guys in this world. We could talk about this until we're blue in the face. There's so many guys that they put women just like, uh, that's the number one, you know, priority is to have a girl, you know, I'm going to go chill with these girls, you know, it's fun to chill with, with, with women, you guys, everybody likes that. But the, the idea that we have to understand is that when we put that, you know, above everything else, it affects everything else. It, it slows us down, you know, it, it dilutes our message. You know, I honestly, I always suggest you guys that as men, we got to work on building our empire first and building ourselves up and then attract the woman, you know, don't be, don't be chasing all these women out here. You guys, it, it will literally derail you from whatever it is that, that you're trying to do in life, you know? Um, yeah, bro. It's just, uh, <laughs> everything is hitting different, you know, when you're interacting with females and that's, that's a good thing. You know, that means that you have transcended you know to a, a new spot you know spiritually um to where we can go around and we treat them like a regular person you know our old selves you guys you know you would treat women like a like a sex object you know like a piece of meat when you're when you're on the websites all the time and you're doing that you energetically you turn into a weirdo you know and girls pick up on that so it's another reason why you start to experience the female attraction is because you are not thinking about women in that way, you know, as much anymore. So guys, we just got to get into this place where we understand that we are the prize, you know, a good man with good morals who has a relationship with God. I mean, come on, we are, we are the prize, you know, and that's not to downplay women or anything, but it's rare nowadays, you know, guys like us, you know, who have a relationship with God, who are not living in their lust, you know, and we're focused on other things. We're focused on, you know, a more righteous pathway, you know? So if you understand that and you operate like that and you go around with that confidence, um, yeah, you're gonna notice a lot of a lot of women are, a lot more women are gonna be into, you know? Um, and sometimes you guys, if you have to, you can hang out with these girls. Like, like I said, I'm not really in that space right now to where, I was kind of doing it, you know, trying to go on dates and things like that. And I realized that it was kind of like a dead end because I'm not where I would like to be yet, you know, spiritually. So um, you can hang out with these girls like for practice, you know what I mean? So you could be around them and try to uh, have self-control, you know, and uh, control your lust and just, you know, be strictly platonic with these females, you know, and see what happens. Um, but just be careful, you guys, because it's it's definitely a dangerous spot. If you're if you're focused on being on semen retention long term, I would be careful. Um, but yeah, bro, it's just totally different, man. And and it's a good thing. And I wanted to make this video to let you guys know that uh, we're all going through this. It's not just you, you know. So just stay strong and and keep working on yourself. Keep putting yourself first, and uh, eventually we'll get to this place to where you will attract the the right woman for you so all right guys that's my message for you on this one hopefully you guys enjoyed it and uh catch you soon man peace out guys